Chinese Xiao Fan. I think most of the Hong Kong people know about it. So therefore, today I did not bring his uh, photo. Fan Zai. But uh, Chao Wei family that she didn't know about it. Did everyone else know? Yeah. yeah. Uh, they yeah. like it like that. Yeah, so I used more time to describe him. <laughs> Um, but there is uh, just a left, uh, 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 finish his life, uh, December life, December life this year. Uh, he, he is, um, uh, in 1991, uh, originally he graduated from the education uh, college. He should be a teacher because he's already got the employment contract. He should be the teacher this year, or that year in September. Uh, he is a cheerful outgoing, confidence. So all the people expect he can be a very esteemed teacher. Before uh, September, in June, he has uh, a, a soul for the college, for the graduation ceremony. He practiced the Samakwang. Samakwang. Sorry, the is very difficult. All the things is very difficult for me to remember. Some assault, yes, sorry. <laughs> sorry, some assault. He felt uh, during the summer assault, he broke his uh, central uh, nervous system. Yeah, after this uh, accident, um, uh, below his head, all his body cannot move. That means uh, <coughs> we expect he can speak and breathe. Actually, is, uh, he cannot speak, cannot breath, uh, cannot walk, cannot wipe, whatever thing he cannot do. Uh, the doctor uh, opened a hole in his left and put in a breathing machine. He is uh, breath by using this machine. So for him, how to communicate, only use his eyeball and then use the lip, lip language. So actually, this kind of a life is uh, very tragedy for us to think about. Actually, I know it's a very tragedy. I, I don't know how it, it was actually. Um, after he, he, actually at that time, he said he forced to leave because he still have a girlfriend. I checked the story. If he has a girlfriend, the girlfriend say that uh, she need to study. And then uh, she left Hong Kong. Later on, she back to Hong Kong. But she become his uh, forever friend, not girlfriend. So at that time, it's uh, uh, Banza is a very alone. Uh, with the support from his uh, family, uh, his father is uh, age over seventy with a heart disease. But every day, his uh, father is uh, without any condition. Every day, go to the hospital in Queens Mary Hospital to help him to cleaning, uh, toileting. Having to eat him, breathing, every day is like that. Due to his family unlimited uh, love to him, he feel very neglected to his family. And whatever, uh, uh, his father is very old, and then the money is a, a big burden to his family. Because the family machine, every month need to pay uh, over $10,000 for the maintenance. So after 12 years, uh, is the uh, 2003. Um, he know how to use the chopstick. He used his mouth to hold the chopsticks and then hit the keyboard of the computer and then write the letter. He write the letter to the chief executive officer, uh, Dr. Uh, Mr. Dong Chi Wang, and the legislative council. His letter is uh, like that. He say, uh, life is uh, maybe very worthwhile for someone, but time is uh, meaningless for him because every day he see uh, the time is uh, goes uh, pass by, but he's uh, just uh, waiting for the day of time. So at that time, uh, what he wants uh, uh, Mr. Dong Chiwa to help him is uh, uh, let him to determine his life. He wants to die. He wants to uh, control his life, and then it is only way to get back his uh, self-respect. Uh, it is a quote from his letter to the uh, Mister Tong Chiwa. So he say uh, in that time.
countries uh, sent numerous letters to uh, Mr. Tong and the Legislative Council. The, the letters, uh, pa, uh, the time stream is talking about one year. And at that time in Hong Kong, even now, Hong Kong do not allow euthanasia. <laughs> euthanasia, do not allow. And our legal system, it is not allowed. Until now, it's not allowed. So he, uh, the doctor and the uh, hospital authority just pressured him, you continue to, lie, uh, to live, you do cannot, you cannot suicide, even though you do not have energy to suicide, and then we do not allow you to suicide. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, later on, the press uh, reported, know about his story, and know about this young man has already in the hospital uh, stay for 12 years. So his uh, story, uh, publicized, publicized to the public. Uh, most of the people, a lot of the people uh, know about it. They send the loving cards, the loving letter, donate money, and give some books to him. So, uh, but uh, later on in April of 2004, so one year later, he write the letter back to the uh, public uh, while the press reporter. Uh, he said that I uh, is so motivated. He received a lot of letters, uh, and then the reporters so aggressively uh, uh, interview all his family member, all his classmate, uh, all his uh, friend, whatever. Want to understand him? And then he see some letters. The most motivating is uh, the, those letters from the primary school students. He know that this student, uh, he learned about these two words, but they still try their hard to write the letter to him. So he's motivated, and then he decided, he said, he has to live again. So in 2006, uh, Dr. Dr. Stephen William Hawking, it's also have uh, this kind of problem. He go to the Hong Kong University, have a, a press seminar, the, the hospital authority arranged uh, sorry, arranged uh, interview between Fan Zai and Dr. Hawking. Dr. Hawking just tell him that no matter what kind of tragedy you encounter in your life, work hard and you will be successful. So Fan Zai is very motivated and then he become a, an author. He writes his book, his uh, own autobiography. So, <laughs> uh, sorry, the story for him is quite long. You don't really his autobiography right now. <laughs> <laughs> I just uh, finished uh, 50%. <laughs> oh! <laughs> because it's a long, long story, I, I cannot know how to soften it. Is it allow me few seconds? Give me another speech. Maybe the end. Part two. Okay. Anyway, uh, finally he is um, uh, decided to live again, and then he died this year. Uh, why I say he is uh, Hong Kong memory? Because uh, in this uh, past uh, twenty years, uh, we know this uh, hopeless young young people. Uh, he decided to die, and later on, due to the part of the Hong Kong people's caring, he decided to live again. So this uh, story tells us that uh, life is uh, unexpected. Life is unexpected. Fortune is not mandatory. But like the doctor mentioned, say that uh, we keep on work hard, and then uh, we will success one day, and then we become one of the Hong Kong memory. So in this... Uh, Jolly, holy Christmas. Hope we can use uh, our holiday to remember uh, one of the uh, special person of Hong Kong. So back to you. <laughs>